Hey my Jelly Beans, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to play the Mary Smasher Pass Challenge. And this is a really old trend that went around and I am always late to every single trend, every single challenge on YouTube. I'm about two years too late, but I still do them because they're fun. And today's video, I really wanted to just kind of pick some different LGBT YouTubers and celebrate Pride Month by deciding whether or not I am going to Mary Smash or Pass them. <laughs> So in this video, what it really is, is you either are going to marry, smash, or pass. Marry really just is you're going to be with them for the rest of your life. Smash means you're going to have sex with them. And pass means you're going to kind of tell them to hit the curb and kick them out. If I'm being completely honest, I would love to be friends with every single person in this video. And I love their videos. So that's all I got to say on that. But if you're not subscribed to my channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button and join the squad. I do make a lot of videos about sexuality and just my life in general. So if that's something you're into, be sure to subscribe. But we're just gonna hop into this video and play some Mary Smash or Pass. So my first three choices are between Ricky Dillon, Jack Meridu, and Connor Franta. And I've watched all their videos. I enjoy all of them. I really like Ricky's personality. Jack is so funny. And Connor Franta, even though I never really got into him, I love his thumbnails. I love the way that he's just so real in his videos. But ultimately, I'm gonna say I am going to marry Ricky Dillon because I love his personality. I think that we would be really good friends and in a relationship in a marriage, you need someone that you're friends with and you need someone that you get along with. And I think our personalities would be very compatible. So I'm going to marry Ricky Dillon. I am going to smash Jack Meridu because he is just one good looking cute guy and <laughs> I would love to smash. And as far as passing, I am going to pass on Connor Franta just because personally, I just don't relate to him as much as I do the other two. The next round is Elena Joy, My Life is Ava, and Ingrid Nilsson. I am going to smash Ava. She's adorable. She's really sweet. She's someone I could see myself really getting along with, leading from one step to the next. As far as Mary, I am going to marry Elena. She just seems like a really nice person and someone I could see myself being friends with and just enjoying life together and just being a really good pair and as far as passing I am going to pass on Ingrid because I really don't know much about her I've never really watched her videos that much I've seen a few I've seen her coming out videos I've seen her reacting to people's coming out but I never really sat down and watched a lot of her videos. I've never really felt that connection that I felt with the other two third round okay here are some big names in the industry James Charles Jeffree Star and Manny MUA for the three if I'm being completely honest. I am going to smash James Charles. He just seems like a cool guy. I'm going to marry Jeffree Star. And the reason I'm going to marry Jeffree Star is because he's got money. He's got a mansion. I need that. And I think, you know what? I can take Nate's place and really be that guy for Jeffree. I could take his money. <laughs> Manny MUA. So, I am going to have to pass on Manny. Just because he doesn't have the money like Jeffree and I don't know how our relationship would be. I don't know how we would would really work out. The fourth round, Shane Dawson, Rylan Adams, and Garrett Watts. Okay, so if I'm being completely honest, I am going to marry Shane Dawson. I would call him out on his bullshit. On every scandal that he's ever been in, you gotta apologize a little bit more. Rylan Adams, I'm sorry, but I'm going to pass on Rylan. And Garrett, I am going to smash Garrett, because he is kind of cute in a nerdy, weird way. Fifth round is Jesse Page, Georgia Bridgers, and my girl Dutchie. So I am going to marry Dutchie, because she does just seem like a sweet girl and I think that we could be a good marriage we could work out we could make our YouTube videos talking about bisexuality talking about our struggles and our lives that would be a really good match made in heaven I'm going to smash Georgia just because she just seems like she would be a really good girl and I'm sorry Jesse but I am going to pass on Jesse and that's only because I just kind of liked the other two girls a little bit better the first person is Aaron Fuller second is Dylan Gaik and the third is Jackson Creel I am going to marry Aaron just because he seems like a wild child. He seems like a wild guy, but I need a little bit of that in my life. I need to get out there. I need to start acting a little different. I need to start gaining some confidence. I am going to smash Dylan because, oh my God. He was number one. He makes me feel some ways and he's in the military now and he was a uh, and he was a wrestler and I have a thing for wrestlers actually one of my old crushes was a wrestler and the third is Jackson I feel like I would have a little bit more fun with the other two than I would Jackson and it is funny with those three because I think they've all kind of like been in relationships with each other I know Jackson dated Dylan and Aaron but I want to thank you guys for watching this video I know it was a little bit different I just thought it'd be fun to play this little game and just sit down with you guys and react to some 
some lovely LGBT YouTubers and just have a good time. But I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you're not subscribed to my channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button and join the Jelly Bean Squad. And if you don't follow my other social media, I'll leave it all linked below so you can check that out. See you guys next time. Raja that.